Hello friends, Mitchell Butel here, the Artistic Director of State Theatre Company South Australia. I hope you all had a very, very happy holiday season and that you're charged and ready for a year of phenomenal theatre with us in 2023. I've just returned to Adelaide from Sydney where our production of Girls and Boys starring the incredible Justine Clarke, which we presented to sold out houses at last year's Adelaide Festival, played to similarly sold out houses and great acclaim at the Sydney Festival at the Seymour Centre. Girls and Boys returns to Adelaide in August and then transfers to the Theatre Royal in Hobart. So if you missed out because of those sold out houses last year, now's your chance to witness an extraordinary actress in an extraordinary play. Speaking of extraordinary, I am witnessing more extraordinary talent in the rehearsal room, this wonderful rehearsal room at the moment, watching four of my favourite Australian actors bring Edward Albee's dark comedy masterpiece, The Goat, or Who is Sylvia, to fresh new life. South Australian favourites Nathan Page and Mark Saturno are dazzling me with their dynamic portrayals. Yazid Daya, fresh from huge success on TV shows like The Hunting and The Heights, is making a stellar stage debut. And riding high on smash hit TV productions like Puberty Blues and Bump and Love My Way, the Logie award winning Claudia Carvin is returning to the stage with her incredible passion and wit and talent. It's a terrific bunch. This truly hilarious but surprising and shocking piece won the Tony Award for Best Play when it premiered on Broadway and it's not hard to see why. It may or may not be about a man falling in love with a goat, but more importantly, it's one of the greatest and craziest and deepest and most devastating explorations of a marriage and family in crisis. Anyone who has ever loved will be able to relate and I know audiences will be floored by its canny observations. It will also make your jaw hit the floor with its twists and turns and emotional tornadoes. It's about the limits of our tolerance and about what happens when someone breaks the rules, the rules of a relationship, the rules of a community, the rule of law. What happens to us when all the pillars of our house and heart start to crumble? It's great stuff. Edward Albee also wrote the classics uh, Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf and A Delicate Balance, for example. But in The Goat or Who is Sylvia, I think he is at his absolute best. The wit and intelligence and daring of this play is truly electric. I am loving directing this piece and bringing it to life in order to challenge and hopefully inspire a whole new generation. Tickets are selling very fast to this production, so don't miss out. It will play at the Dunstan Playhouse from February 10 to February 25. It's also touring to the Sydney Theatre Company after its Adelaide season. Such was the demand for this play and this brilliant cast. In Sydney, it will be playing at the Rosalind Packer Theatre from March 2 to March 25. There are so many brilliant plays in our 2023 season, including The Dictionary of Lost Words and Lady Day at Emerson's Bar and Grill, which will also embark on national tours after their Adelaide seasons. We have great new Australian works, At What Cost, Euphoria and Welcome to Your New Life and fantastic West End hits like Prima Facey and Every Brilliant Thing. There are so many wonderful actors cast in our shows this year and very soon we will be announcing some other very beloved and high profile South Australian stars. Watch this space. It's not too late to subscribe to all our shows in 2023, whether it's four shows or up to all seven shows. If you subscribe, you'll receive huge ticket discounts, great seats, and also huge ticket flexibility if you need to make any changes. So, it's a very exciting time at the company, and I can honestly say I feel such incredible privilege and delight to be working on such great plays with such great actors and teams. I know you'll feel that delight too if you come on the journey with us. So, I'll see you in the theatre very soon. Mm -hmm.